Once you've brought your data into Spotfire, you may need to enrich your dataset with additional calculated columns. Whether you're authoring from the desktop-based analyst client or from the browser-based web author, the Spotfire expression language makes it really easy to add extra content and context to your data discovery. Let's take this example of a simple credit card transaction data set in the US. If I wanted to add a 2% surcharge to all of my transactions, I would use a calculated column. To insert a calculated column, I can either go to my Insert menu and select Calculated Column, or I can open the Data Panel, return to the Data Table view, and click on the Add Calculated Column button on the right. The Insert Calculated Column dialog box appears, showing your columns, properties, and functions that are available to you. We won't cover the properties right now, but they're easy and we'll definitely cover them in a different video. For our surcharge use case, I'll select my Transaction Amounts column and press the Insert Columns button, and then finish off by multiplying that column by 0 0.02. You'll notice that in the lower right part of the screen, you can see key information like sample result and type. The Sample Results Preview button will show you your formula as it's currently written applied to the first 100 records of your dataset. The Formatting button will allow you to change the format of the data itself, with options like currency symbols, number shortening, and date formats, etc. Give it a name and press OK, and now you have a calculated column in your dataset. If your data gets refreshed, the calculated column would simply dynamically recalculate. And if you need to edit the formula, you can always open up the data panel, select your column that you calculated, and then press the Edit button under the Expression section. Let's create another calculated column, which will total the amount and the surcharge. You'll see in the Columns menu, I can use calculated columns that I've already created in this expression. It's also probably worth noting that the expression language is extremely similar to spreadsheet formulas. This is of course intentional so that people who are familiar with Excel or Google Sheets can very easily jump right in with Spotfire expressions. You can explore the huge library of available functions in the menu on the right. Each one has a description and example syntax to help you along the way. It's also worth pointing out that while you can create and edit all the same formulas in our browser-based web author client, it won't have the full list of columns and properties that the desktop analyst does right now. Calculated columns can be visualized and explored exactly the same way that you can any other dimension or measure in your data. You can start enriching your own data today by going to spotfire.tibco.com. If you have any questions, head over to the Spotfire community, where you'll find thousands of people working together to solve real analytic problems. Also, leave any questions or suggestions in the comments, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.